Well, right now, Kansas City Council members are trying to figure out how to make another round of huge budget cuts. Well, Chris Hernandez explains how the cuts are hitting beyond the fire and police departments now. Chris? Yeah, the city's public works director says Kansas City will still concentrate on core functions like plowing the streets and picking up the trash. But budget cuts could cause more potholes in the streets and more leaves left at the curb. Some KCMO residents have already put brush piles at the curb. Each year, the city picks up leaves and brush once in the spring and twice in the fall. To save money, Public Works proposes eliminating the spring pickup next year. The city council suggested cutting one of the fall pickups. At Public Works, we're cutting about $40 million. In the last five years, we've cut it by about 60%. They'd still fill potholes, but street reconstruction money could be eliminated. That means zero rather than the two and a half million dollars this year. It would delay some maintenance. In the long run, that will create more labor intensive activities such as more potholes and so forth. We know that, but we also need a minimum staff to, to be maintained to meet those core functions. Those core functions are things like weekly trash pickup and snow removal. McIntyre says she's trying to reset the Public Works Department to get through the next five years on a lean budget. But the hope is that the economy recovers faster than that. We hope that the sales tax and the general property taxes go up. The city also wants you to recycle as much as you can. The rate paid to the city for recyclables has gone way up, and that's more revenue for the city when you recycle and less the city pays to dump the trash in the landfill. The Public Works budget does call for more money spent to fight illegal dumping. Kansas City also has to make a final decision on this budget by the end of the month. Chris Hernandez, 41 Action News.